Hi all champions, so GATE 2024 examinations have been just recently conducted and there comes a big announcement for all GATE 2024 aspirants, yes. One of the Mini Ratna, all you know AI Airport Authority of India has given this time a bumper vacancies for all of you, for all those who have appeared in the GATE 24 examinations, okay. So there is no separate examination of AI, okay, because at many times they take a separate examination, okay, but it's the recruitment of the, the junior executives purely through the gate 2024 and as I mentioned bumper vacancies okay so I'll just tell you okay what are how many of these vacancies branch wise as well and what is the eligibility criteria okay what is the total selection procedure is there only or only through gate 24 or there are some other elements when you can apply what is the fees to apply so guys a very important update for all gate 2024 aspirants and this also gives a message let me tell in the beginning even if you are a gate 25 or 26 aspirant remember okay many times students leave the preparation and don't prepare because they think yeah no i don't want to go for masters of course for many masters uh, degree is a dream but many people feel that psus i don't know how many psus will come or not so see gate exam conducted then the notification coming similarly it will happen in the next year and it happens every year some PSUs notify, you know, prior to the exam, many PSUs notify after the exam and it's just the beginning, not only just after the exam, you know, eventually maybe 3, 4, 5 months down the line also you will keep seeing recruitment through gate 24, gate 24, gate 24. Okay, so guys, yeah, let's get started the Mini Ratna AI. Okay, on 16, this is the notification dated 16th of February. Now comes this one. Okay, have a look into it. Okay, the important thing that you need to know about the vacancies. Okay, uh, electronics guys, the highest one for electronics. Okay, junior executive electronics 278. Okay, for electrical it is 106. Okay, then there is for civil, okay, 90 vacancies. 13 are for information technology, IT posts are there and 3 are for architecture. Okay. So these many, you know, if I leave apart the architecture also, these many are the vacancies which will be nearly summing up to uh, around uh, approximately 500, just less than 500. So it's a bumper opportunity, okay, in this particular mini Ratna. Okay, so, you know, never miss up. This is all a boost up, uh, you know, uh, to what whatever hard work you have put into place. Now, let's talk about some important stuff here. Okay. Uh, about the educational qualifications. As I mentioned, it is on the basis of GATE 2024. Okay, but in the GATE 2024, uh, which branch code? Okay, because many of you might have filled uh, through two papers uh, for the GATE this time. Okay, but suppose uh, you uh, want to be recruited as Junior Executive Electronics, then your GATE paper should be GATE EC only and that should be, okay, uh, that, that should be a primary paper. Okay, if you are from EC, your primary paper should be GATE EC. No other, uh, like if you have secured a rank in IN, that is not going to work. That is what I want to say here. Okay, so uh, that's what. Okay, so if you're looking for Junior Executive Electronics, you need to have I hold a bachelor's degree in engineering maybe B, maybe B, B tech okay in electronics or telecommunication or electrical with specialization in electronics okay take it so electronics and communication gate paper only okay similarly for electrical okay you should have the B tech in electrical B, B tech in electrical with the gate paper code as electrical for civil bachelor's B, B tech in civil with the civil with the gate paper also uh, with the civil only okay and uh, same for IT, of course for IT the gate paper is definitely CS, there is no IT these days, bohat saalo pehle hota tha, but now there is only one paper that is the CS, okay, but yeah in CS, okay, uh, maybe B, B tech also applicable, okay, in computer science or computer engineering or IT because in some of the branches still, the IT branches are there, many of the colleges, okay, even electronics uh, can apply for this post, okay, but even MCA students can also apply, okay. Uh, for this particular vacancy okay now let's come up to some more important updates age limit regular as expected for most of the PSUs it is 27 as on 1st of May because I'll tell you this is going to be the last day of the filling up of the form so as of 1st of May 2024 your age uh, should be 27 or below that's the maximum age allowed of course there are relaxations as other organizations do give you there's relaxation by 5 years for SCSC and 3 years for the OBC non-creamy layer right now, important dates as I was just mentioning you. Okay, so the online application form has not yet started. It's going to start on 2nd of April 2024. Okay, 2nd of April 2024. So, there is there is a lot of time left. Okay, but still, uh, you know, you should be aware about this notification. Okay, the form to jab bhi aayega, definitely bhar denge. But you should be aware so that, you know, you can make your decisions accordingly. Whether you want to go for MTech course or any other PSU or uh, whether your dream job is AI. Because, you know, definitely... Okay, looking into the infrastructural development, you know, the developments of the airports, okay, definitely I can say that the future in AI is definitely going to be a brighter one. Okay, now, uh, okay, uh, one thing is important, ki, you, know, you have to only apply online, there is no offline application and that is going to be on this particular website, www.ai.aero, 
ऑल राइट ठीक है सो पे स्केल एज यू नो यू गोइंग टू स्टार्ट एस जूनियर एग्जीक्यूटिव इन द इवन एग्जीक्यूटिव वन लेवल ओके इट्स अ ग्रुप बी पोस्ट सो बेसिक पे इज फोर्टी थाउजेंड टू वन लैक फोर्टी थाउजेंड ओके बट इन एडिशन टू द बेसिक पे यू नो यू नो दैट इट्स एंड ऑफ द डे पी एस यू देर आर सेवरल अदर बेनिफिट्स अदर दैन द स्टेबिलिटी ऑफकोर्स द बिगेस्ट फैक्टर वेन यूर जॉइनिंग पी एस यू और इवन गवर्मेंट ऑर्गनाइजेशन इज द स्टेबिलिटी फैक्टर विच इज ऑलवेज मिसिंग इन अ प्राइवेट ऑर्गनाइजेशन हाउ एवर हाई सैलरीज मे बी बट डेफिनेटली ओके एज द क्लियरली मैंशन हेयर द सी टी सी ऑल्सो नाउ द जॉइनिंग सी टी सी okay uh, you know for just an engineering graduate i think 13 lakhs in in a psu is is really good is really good the ctc to the company will be 13 lakhs okay so there will be basic pay da okay there will be increments okay there will be perks okay hra other benefits okay which include cpf gratuity social security schemes medical benefits for you for your dependents i mean okay they give you uh, medical facilities they give you food they give you house to live okay so mostly what you get you know the basic pay is all your savings so that's also a very good benefit okay now selection procedure very important the very very important selection procedure okay jiski hum baat karna cha rahe the okay so uh, look into it guys okay very clearly they have mentioned that only those candidates who have appeared in gate 24 in the relevant disciplines which i mentioned with relevant engineering degree theek hai they are eligible to apply okay on the basis of the details furnished candidates shall be shortlisted for application verification so see guys one important thing is okay that many of the engineers they also worry and they are little bit fearful about the interview procedures okay many psus conduct the interview procedure as well but here it's scrutinized only on the basis of your performance in the gate okay followed by the application and basically document verification you can say so no interview no group discussions so it's a very good like again say bale bale opportunity for you we just ठीक है इफ यू हैव डन गुड इन गेट ओके द नेक्स्ट मंथ रिजल्ट्स विल बी आउट आंसर की आ चुका है तो यू माइट हैव गॉट एन एनालिसिस व्हाट यू हैव डन ओके एंड द नंबर ऑफ वैकेंसी से इफ यू आर इलेक्ट्रॉनिक्स 278 एंड नॉट ऑल टॉप 278 विल ओनली गो फॉर एआई ना मेनी एस्पिरेंट्स विल बी गोइंग फॉर मेनी एस्पिरेंट्स विल बी गोइंग फॉर डिफरेंट पीएसयूज ओके लाइक आईओसीएल और एटसेट्रा 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 एंड एट द सेम टाइम मेनी एस्पिरेंट्स ओके विल बी अप्लाइंग फॉर मास्टर्स आल्सो इट्स नॉट लाइक पीपल ओनली राइट फॉर पीएसयू there are several students who her dream is for higher education only okay so so definitely you know i can say that i mean it's a choice of candidates but this year okay looking into these vacancies and there are many more psus and mtech seats even if you have ranked 1000 or little beyond that now you have very good opportunity you have good opportunity i will say even till 1500 2000 rank but even if you have rank around 1000 now you will have some you know uh, very good opportunities uh, in your hand okay maybe a good iit seat or maybe a good psu uh uh job for you right guys theek hai so uh, that's what okay so purely on the basis of gate score in case uh, they have also mentioned uh, you know ye tie wali baat ki in case if there is a tie between the, the gate score of two candidates then how do they uh, overcome this situation okay number one age na you know if suppose gate score tie the age will be the criteria the older one in age will get the job ओके इवन इफ एज इज टाइम बहुत अनरियलिस्टिक है मतलब बहुत लेस प्रोबेबिलिटी वाला इवेंट है दैट योर गेट्स को एंड योर एग्जैक्ट डेट ऑफ बर्थ विल बी इक्वल ओके बट स्टिल इफ दैट हैपेंस देन योर परफॉर्मेंस इन द बैचलर्स कोर्स ओके योर इंजीनियरिंग कोर्स वुड बी कंसीडर्ड ओके अ वेरी लीस्ट प्रोबेबल इवेंट इन दैट इज ओके गाइस सो नाउ कमिंग अप टू सम मोर प्रोबेबली द लास्ट इंपॉर्टेंट अपडेट ओके ये फोटोग्राफ कैसे अपलेट कर रहे हैं देख लेंगे आई वाज टेलिंग यू देयर विल बी अ वेरी देयर इज अ वेरी वेरी नॉमिनल एप्लीकेशन फी इट्स नॉट लाइक 1000 और 2000 और समथिंग लाइक दैट इट्स ओनली अ मेयर फी ऑफ 300 रुपीस ओके थ्रू ऑनलाइन मोड एंड आल्सो इट इज रिलैक्स्ड ओके इफ यू आर एससी एसटी पीडब्ल्यूडी कैंडिडेट ओके इफ यू आर वन ऑफ द अप्रेंटिस अप्रेंटिस हु हैव कंप्लीटेड 1 ईयर ऑफ ट्रेनिंग और इफ यू आर अ फीमेल कैंडिडेट okay so you know for a lot of uh, categories the relaxation is also there but even if 300 you have to pay it's a very very nominal fee all right guys so i think that's it that's the big update coming up from ai yes guys so again i repeat the application will start from april it's clearly mentioned second of april 2024 it's going to go till may but uh, you know whether it starts in april again i repeat it should set a reminder it should set a clear decision in mind whether you have to wait for it accordingly you have to take a decision which mtech to apply or which uh, uh you know psu to apply or not to apply if you are waiting for this and if you believe your performance is good and by the time april comes the result will also be out so you know by the time the picture will be crystal clear in front of you and again i repeat in the end that in case if you are any of the aspirant of the upcoming year 2025 26 of the upcoming year remember guys okay before writing the exam don't think that how many vacancies are there currently because currently you cannot guess also currently you know that 
definitely you should only target that if you go to the right gate examination okay definitely either you will be having a good iit seat okay with a good specialization or a good psu job how many psu jobs that you will only come to ne know next year okay and maybe not only exactly after gate exam many psus will come you know maybe two four five months after the gate examination okay so don't keep on worrying on about the numbers okay just keep worrying about your preparation whether you want them or not and if you want them do not you know compromise with your preparation keep preparing hard throughout the year the gate 25 should be yours for message for the future aspirants okay and congratulations for the 24 aspirants for getting such a bumper opportunities in aai all the best thank you bye bye stay safe and this is rakesh Salreja signing off